I look like a surfer destined to be attacked by a shark. Hello friends, how you doing? Well, I hope, I got braids again. I hope you like it. Got a little swirly part. Um, so yeah, the video, let's just jump right into this. I low key feel bullied into this video. I'm kidding, but only a little because there are so many comments asking me to try Fashion Nova. My brain always would explode when I would get these comments like, please try Fashion Nova, please, 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 please. And I'm like, yo, that brand is all over the internet. They own, and so I'm sure they have stock in Instagram, you know? Why do you need me to try it? Um, it's all over the place, like everyone's wearing it. Um, so there are a lot of reasons that I personally haven't tried Fashion Nova. Number one, I think that um, I wasn't really generally attracted to the clothes that much. It's a very kind of like party girl, Vegas dresses. I don't know, like it's very Instagram fashion, which for me is a little bit outside of fashion fashion. Um, so that's one thing. And um, I don't know. I just felt like also the sizing would probably be ter terrible on me. The body types on their website are literally the opposite of mine. And I know that they are more in the junior plus sizing. So the thing that that's crazy is when you look at the website and you look at their sizing, the 3X says 22, 24, but they are not telling the truth. That 3X is absolutely not a 22, 24. So I kind of thought that and then um, you know, I feel like they're not really like the most supportive of influencers, which, you know, is a whole other deal. Um, but anyway, you guys asked and I recently, I got an email from them. They email me all the time asking like, hey, can we send you stuff? But then they have these like crazy stipulations. Like you want to send me a $30 dress and you want to send me like, you know, all these rules and regulations of what I have to do. I was like, forget that. I'll spend my own money and tell the truth, you know, if it is good, if it is bad, um, the good, the bad, and the ugly. So uh, that prompted me to kind of give the website a second look. So I went on the website and I was like, wow, there are actually some things here that I think are kind of cute. Um, a lot of which uh, I, I knew not to even try. So I was like, let me just stick to stuff that's stretchy. I know that they're 20, they're 3X, I should say, is definitely more of an 18 maybe a 16. Um, in some cases when things are stretchy, you can get away with it. But let me just stick to the stretchy stuff and I probably should be good. Well, that didn't quite work out as expected. <laughs> So what I did is I ordered six things. Um, three of them were successful. I was shook. Three of them very much were not. Um, so for the sake of, of fun, I'm gonna kind of mix and match. Like I'll probably show you one that worked and one that didn't. So let's just jump into the haul. I'm gonna tell you right now, this dress is such a disappointment because I've seen this dress in skinny sizes. I've seen it in like like higher end brands, um, kind of in different degrees, but this like scrunchy dupe dress that is everywhere right now. It's like lots of scrunches, lots of ruching is the proper term. Uh, ruching AKA scrunchy dupes. Um, but I saw this dress and I was like, holy crap, if this works, I am going to be such a happy camper. It did not work, <laughs> you guys. So when I opened up the package, and saw uh, the size of the dress, I was beside myself. Like I actually fell out laughing onto my bed. This, do you see this? This is the 3X. Excuse me? <laughs> I can't even look at it without laughing. Like it's hard to read it on camera cause the arms are long, but like the body of the dress is this wide. Like here's the body. And here's my body. So it's essentially half of my body. This dress is so freaking cute. These scrunchies here and this like off the shoulder and this arm. So what I think is, is that, cause I see people online who are not that much smaller than me wearing it. Cause I've seen them in real life. But I think the key is this. One, 
you can't be very tall because everything is so short. This is the entire length of the dress. And to be very honest, when I bought this dress, I was just like, look, there's no way this is gonna not show my vagine. But wouldn't this be a hella cute shirt tucked into jeans? That was my thought. Like, this is not gonna be a dress on me. I can't even try this on for you because it will rip it. And it's so cute that I'm going to give it to Carla or Christine, like whoever fits it. I, I swear I think Carla can fit this and Carla is like a 10, 12. Um, Christine is probably like a 14, 12, 14. It's going to fit one of them. So I didn't want to like break it or rip it or mess up the arms because it's just so, so, so cute. Um, but what I think is this, you can't be tall um, and I'm five foot 10. Uh, you cannot be top heavy because these arms are really small. And I think that because everything is cut for kind of like hourglass or pear shapes where you're like short, you know, narrow shoulders, even if you have boobs, it's still like your shoulders are narrow and then your body comes out at the bottom. Um, so I think it's like being the fact that I'm big, I'm top heavy and I'm tall, uh, <laughs> This was a joke. Let's move on to something that actually did work. It is this leopard dress. Um, I'm obsessed with this thing. Like, sorry, I just burped. This dress is so cute. And it's one of those like super easy. It was $12.99. Um, I mean, wow. It's just a bodycon dress. So this is the other three. This is a 3X2. But look at the difference of this and the white dress. Like the white dress was half of this. The white dress was like this big. And this is actually closer, I would say, to a Forever 21 3X, which is more of an 1820. So since this is more of a 20, look, it's like closer to my body. It's not my exact size, but it's also stretchy. And in the midi length, it was long enough. So it came like just above the knee. So. I'm a fan. I love this dress. I think it was just super cute. I would totally wear this. Like I actually felt comfortable wearing it alone. Um, and as we go into the winter months, I think laying a moto over it or a trench coat looked super cute. And yeah, I was, I was excited about this and 13 bucks. Back to more shenanigans. Another dress that did not work out for me. I'm starting to think that their dresses just are not for me. And it's the same situation as the other scrunchy dupe dress. Look at the width of this. This is a 3X and it's long. This is a 3X, you guys. I mean, at least it's, the, it's a good length, but this dress is so freaking small. <laughs> Again, I, I tried this dress on and I actually could pull it over my chest, but I heard like, seams popping and things going awry. Um, and there's also a really high slit in the back that didn't even cover my, my butt cheeks. So I didn't want to ruin it because I know that um, Carla Christine would really love this dress. It is so cute. The quality is decent. Like it's not like some beautiful material or anything, but it's not see-through. Like a lot of dresses um, from other places like this where, you know, it's like super, super fast fashion. Um, the straps are, are like well adhered. I don't know, like I'm not mad at Fashion Nova in terms of the quality of their items and um, like what I purchased. It's more just like when it fits, it's great. And when it doesn't, it's an actual joke. Um, so I don't know how I would predetermine, you know, when you're ordering something that has plenty of stretch, if it's gonna come in like half the size or if it's going to be, you know, a little bit more true. So this dress did not work out. Um, maybe I'll pop in a photo of the model in it so you can know what it's supposed to look like. And if you're interested, I would say if you are larger than an 18, um, or if you're like a pear shaped 20, like you have to be smaller on the top for this to go across your body, then you're probably good. If you're any bigger than that, don't play yourself like I did. I wish to God I was recording right now. I was turning this back, you know, right side in and I zipped up the zipper and the zipper literally slid right off. What the actual hell? I was about to praise this thing. I'm so pissed. The zipper, I mean, it flew right off, like zipping it up and went whoop, right off. This, I was about to say, was my favorite thing. This, I was about to say, is so not me, but also me at the same time. It's this one piece, like shorts, I don't know, it's like scuba gear, but an outfit. And I'm sure like, you know, the Instagram girls would wear this with like some heels or slouchy boots or something and just be all sexy and be like, you know, with their lip gloss and all of that. I just thought it was kind of cool. Um, I would wear it with a denim jacket, which I will show you. Um, I cannot believe 
this just happened. Like it, you guys, how? It slid right the frig off. Will it go back on? I don't think so. I, like, and I don't even understand. And then also there's nothing on the track to stop it. So maybe that's my bad for not knowing it would come off like that. But holy cow. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna work because before it slid down like very regularly, quite normal. Wow. That is a mess. That is a whole mess. And how much was this thing? This was $24.99. So of course, like one of the more expensive items from this site. I cannot believe this. What an actual bummer. I like it. Yeah, it's not. It's, oh, there we go. So now it's just going to be broken forever because like you can't, you know. Well, there we are. This is trash. Congratulations. Don't buy that. I feel like I just suffered a great loss. I really like that stupid thing and I was excited to shoot it from my Instagram. But I'm glad that it happened. So now that you'll know not to get it because that is problematic AF. Okay, back to another thing that didn't work. It was a dress. I only had six, so I ordered three dresses and I only had six set, no, I ordered four dresses and I only had success with one. Um, it's this. So this, I actually just saw on another girl on um, IG. She's she's a pretty fuller girl, but she's small on top, so she's a pear shape. Uh, and that was kind of my issue. This dress would have fit. So this is a 3X, aside from the fact that it's also very, very short. Like, look how short this is. It's not even as long as my torso. Um, so if you are petite and probably up to a size 22, I think you're gonna be good, um, especially if you're bottom heavy. Uh, if you're tall and you're on the smaller side of plus, so if you're tall and you're 14 or 16, you're good. Uh, but if you're tall and any bigger than that, I think you might have some issues uh, with your, you know, cheeks hanging out and such, unless that's what you're going for, in which case, like, do it, you know? Let those cheeks live, honey. But I had an issue with the arms. So the arms were too small for me. And then of course, across the, the width of the shoulders. Uh, so the body of the dress fit, but then the shoulders didn't so much fit. And I didn't want to, um, you know, mess up the little cute ruffly dupes here. Uh, but overall, even if it did fit, it's very much a shirt on me, not a dress. I think this would be really cute on someone. Maybe we'll have Jess try it on. This was $27.99. Um, or my cousin Lynn might actually want this. She's tall, but she's smaller. So someone in my life will get this dress and be very happy. It's really, really cute. I do wish that someone like ASOS who cut things like in actual sizes and um, even though they do fast fashion, the quality is usually pretty standard and things aren't like extremely short. I wish someone would make this in a midi length in a you know in a size that would fit me like whoever you are if it's forever 21 if it's like whoever make me this dress someone please moving on to the last thing that did work out for me and dare i say it i'm like almost nervous now like these are these were my second favorite to that white scuba thing it's these tights they look you know like a proper size they're probably a size 20 um which stretch out of course because they're stretchy these things are so soft I, I'm not really sure how they're gonna wear. Like, I feel like they're so soft that if your thighs rub, that it might get like all that pill, you know, those little beads on the fabric, or I'm not really sure how they're gonna, you know, wash well. Definitely don't put these in the dryer. But kind of for a wear a couple of times type of item, these are $17.99. And uh, yeah, I mean, I think they're cute. They look very, they're very clueless vibes. They give me such 90s vibes. I would totally wear these with like a t-shirt, like knotted um, in the winter, I think, or not winter, but fall, a denim jacket over these would be super cute, or a moto. Um, and then I threw on some Vans. I like these a lot. And I walked around a little bit in them because I threw them on to do the try on portion. But then I was like, oh, I'm thirsty. I went to the kitchen and then I ran downstairs and I went to the mailbox and blah, blah, blah. Um, so I moved around in them quite a bit. And I like that the waist stayed still. The waist didn't like start sliding and they didn't like roll down or anything. So you're good there.
Wow, you guys, what a roller coaster, what a ride. Um, I, I don't know. So I think my all in all thoughts, my all in all, I don't know, my final thoughts on Fashion Nova uh, is that it's not as bad as I thought. I definitely like some of the items just aesthetically on the side. I thought I wouldn't even like like aesthetically what it looks like, but I definitely like some pieces. I think that if you are above a size 20, it's a bit of a struggle scene, but you know, it's kind of hit or miss. Um, and I think that uh, I'm really freaking bummed that that stupid scuba thing broke like that. Oh, what a bummer. Um, so yeah, I, I liked what I got. Like I liked what I liked and um, I kind of liked everything to be honest. I just wish that it all fit. Um, those are my thoughts. I don't know that it's a company that I would be like wearing all the time or investing in, you know, like I don't think I'm going to be perusing this site often, but I think, you know, if you're 25 and, you know, fit in there, their realm of what you know a 2 or a 3x is uh, I think it's a good affordable option for like trends and looking cute when you feel like it so I don't know my darlings I don't know I give it like I feel like I'm gonna give it a 5 out of 10 I was totally prepared very honestly totally prepared to give it a 7 out of 10 in terms of what I reorder but that zipper flying off just knocked it down two pegs so I'm giving it a 5 out of 10 because I really like the tights I really like my leopard dress and I did really like all the other pieces they just didn't fit my body so which is fair enough because like everything is not made for you that's it we did it you guys Fashion Nova we we did it we did it I'm still shook at that zipper. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please do. I talk about fashion, I talk about beauty, I talk about travel, I talk about, you know, fun things, loving yourself. We try to, you know, keep a positive attitude around these parts. Um, yeah, I mean, that's it. I love you, mean it. Bye. Bye, scuba thing. Ooh. <laughs>